what's up welcome back to my channel this video is probably gonna be all over the place my daughter is acting up and it's almost nap time your girl just finished a 20 minute at home workout i will show some of the workout here this is my first workout since like october right before my breakup your girl was at the gym she signed up for la fitness she was back on her workout game and I started to slim down a lot. Since the breakout, I have not been able, since the breakup, I have not been able to bounce back. I've had zero motivation and I've just been struggling. Now, if you're new here, please subscribe, join the family, smash that thumbs up button, comment any video ideas down below. Okay, baby. And join the family. Also follow me on Instagram. I got two pages, Toxic Beauty, as well as my main page, JessicaFunas.xo. I will link them down below. And I don't really go by the scale, but I am close to 200 pounds. My average like goal weight would be like 175. I know that that sounds like a lot, but I'm 5'7 and a half, and I'm a tall girl. And when I like, if I get down to like 150, I feel like I look too skinny. I literally just stopped the workout. <laughs> um, I yeah i get too skinny and i don't like it and i'm kind of traumatized because when i was like pre-college days i used to be so skinny that i used to get made fun of i was called anorexic i was just made fun of so badly and i hated it i used to wear like sweatpants underneath my jeans or my uniform just to make myself look like i had some meat yes baby good job go make a dinosaur okay i'll be right there give me two seconds good job so yeah so i get traumatized when i start to look too skinny so my goal weight would be like 175. um so last like almost it's approaching the two year mark almost two years ago i had a bbl done after the bbl i weighed like 175 to 180. right now i'm like in the 195 range so i've gained weight and i don't look bad but i don't like the fact that i spent so much money and I'm letting myself go again. Like, when you gain weight after a BBL, they say that it doesn't go to the areas that were lipoed, but two years post-op, and I feel like I do see my stomach getting fat again. And of course, when you do have a BBL done, they lipo certain areas, they put fat in your butt. So the areas that were lipo do probably take a lot longer for you to show the weight gain. Like, it still kind of looks slim, but I noticed that I'm gaining weight and then it also goes all to my butt. So because they put fat there, that gets bigger the minute I start to get weight. And then what else gets bigger is the areas that they didn't lipo. So like this is getting getting fat. My face is getting fat. My father is like the first and I don't want to say getting fat like oh my god. Like I'm not body shaming girls that are overweight, girls that are midweight, girls that are big just like me. I'm not body shaming anybody, but I noticed that my like my cheeks get fat, my neck just looks a little fatter, my hands feel a little fatter, I set my arms already, my thighs gain weight, and again, overall, because I'm tall, it just kind of like stretches out a little bit, but I noticed, and like when I first started my job, which was right after the surgery, I was a size 10, now I'm a size 12, even 14 in some clothes, so like I know I'm definitely like getting wider, and then like I said, the more I gain weight, it goes to my butt. What are you doing? Don't be scared. Yeah, so like I can see the weight coming back here. My back a little bit. My butt is definitely a lot bigger than when I first did the surgery. It's saggy, saggy Uh-huh. Saggy And I still have some problems with my butt that one day I hope to like fix, but that's a whole nother revision. That's a lot of money. If you gain weight, just because they lipo a certain area, it is likely that you will eventually gain fat there. Again, it's not impossible. I know they say it's very unlikely, but it is likely, especially the more time that passes or if you just are really unhealthy, which to be honest is my thing. Like, I probably eat way too much fast food. I got back into the routine of cooking and I'm trying to eat, I'm trying to eat a lot more clean. But like I said, since the breakup, I have started to just eat a lot of pizza, Chinese food, and just like all types of junk McDonald's. And I had started to feel like crap. My body was sluggish. 
And like I said, I just see the roles coming back. And I'm traumatized from it, and I'm sick of it, and I want to just get in shape. So now that we're in quarantine, I want to try to force myself to get back into at-home workouts. The gyms are closed, but I have lots and lots of material here. I have TRX bands, I have resistance bands, I have weights of all different weight ranges, and I have a workout bench, I have a barbell. Like, I have everything that I need to get in shape here. So prior to my channel getting deleted... My original channel got deleted near 5k. I had a lot of workout videos on there and I was sharing my workout routine when I was really trying to slim down. And I hope to do that again now that I am going to get back into it. Today's workout was brutal. It's a workout that I've done before, but for some reason today I just could not power through the way I used to. So, I mean, every time you stop, starting over and getting back is so difficult. So it's so bad to stop and start and stop and start. Like, you're only hurting yourself and you're hindering your growth. So I'm going to wrap this video up. I just wanted to show you guys what I'm looking like. I will try to include some before pictures of when I first got the surgery done versus how I am looking right now. But don't, don't gain weight after a BBL. And if you are going to be eating and gaining weight, at least try to work out too so that you're gaining weight in the right places and not necessarily making your results go to waste. So that's a wrap because my daughter is literally like making a tornado underneath here. I love you, queen. Stay tuned for the next video. Bye, guys. Hold me close till I get up. Time is barely on our side. We're chasing, leading us And love is all we'll ever trust Yeah No, I don't